harnessing the power of the wind is not pollution free. Noise is one of the main complaints for onshore turbines. At this wind farm near the Spanish city of Burgos, technicians are installing a new device which aims to turn down the volume. It could have a major impact on the wind energy market as more companies seek to build turbines onshore near to urban areas, where restrictions on noise are much stricter. Also, wind turbine noise can come at a cost to efficiency, so developing new technology could mean producing more energy whilst emitting less sound. The device is made up of a series of serrated teeth, and its specific design enables the impact of the wind on the trailing edge of the blade to be broken. This subsequently lowers the overall noise of the turbine. At the moment, we're carrying out tests on a wind generator 78 meters high with a rotor diameter of 90 meters. The device which would attach to the blades has been developed by the European project Wind Trust. Taking it even further, they will optimize the use of carbon fiber to make the blades. This should increase their durability and reduce their weight, which would in turn extend the overall life of the turbine. Doing this would also keep maintenance costs down. At this factory near Madrid, researchers are putting a wind converter to the test. It's the device that transforms the mechanical energy of the blades into electricity. Technicians want to maximize the balance between energy production and machine life. The machine you see here is located inside the turbine. It enables the rotational energy of the wind to be converted into electricity. Within Windtrust, we built a new generation of semiconductors to reduce the number of active elements and consequently the number of breakdowns. In addition, we reduce the repair times by 70% and can also work in environments of high pollution and high humidity, as on the offshore sites. We incorporate an algorithm to anticipate a problem before a breakdown occurs. Noise is not the only problem that engineers have to consider with wind power. The interruption of supply due to weather conditions, the difficulties of storing energy, the impact on the environment, the high costs of energy production and the maintenance of equipment all pose problems. In Europe, we want to achieve clean, reliable energy at the lowest possible cost. For this reason, the concept that we must continue working on is reliability. The reliability of wind turbines and of their most important components. So all Windtrust partners have completely reviewed the design of certain components. We can therefore say that we have before us a new generation of components that will not only improve the reliability of onshore machines, but also that of offshore machines. Finding ways of refining wind energy is taking on more importance as European countries aim to reduce CO2 emissions. By reducing noise and increasing energy production, researchers hope to make the transition more harmonious.